Do you remember this editor called FlexClip, which allows you to edit videos just using a browser? You don't need to have any powerful hardware, you just need a device with a browser that can access the internet. They have actually partnered with me to give away three annual licenses to you. Throughout this video, somewhere you'll see a license code like this pop up on the screen. Not, not that, I mean that's just an example. Once you see it, all you have to do is go to flexclip.com, create a free account, you can sign up with your Google account or Facebook, head over to the upgrade option and select the plus plan. And in the billing page, go to that coupon code and add the coupon you see on the screen and that will automatically make the plan free for you. So keep an eye around this video so you'll see three coupon codes pop up somewhere. In the meanwhile, let's check out the editor, I mean I have used this before and I have even made a video but in case you don't know what that is, let's explore. I'm just gonna log into my account. I have a business plan as you can see because I'm a boss. It has everything you need, you know, it has built in templates or you can start from scratch. I like the timeline mode more than the storyboard mode. So that'll just load up this interface and you can even import your own files. The only problem with this online editor is of course if you import your own media, it has to be uploaded to their servers first. So you need a speedy internet connection to do this in real time, you know. So if you have like a lot of clips you're trying to edit, then this may not be a good option because you literally have to upload several gigabytes. But if you're just trying to put together a short video for social media, then they have their own stock video library. You can use any of these videos for free just with a click. It'll just download to your timeline and now you can edit that. You can adjust the color, contrast, etc. as you want. You can transform the frame as well. You can switch the aspect ratio as you need. You can see everything works pretty fast in real time. And once you're done with it, you can export it. The basic plan only allows up to 720p, but these plus plan, which three of you will get, allows you 1080p exports. There are some interesting overlays and elements you can add, and there's even a picture-in-picture -picture mask, like the way I do my videos. Simply drag and drop your face cam clip onto that element, and boom. You can then click adjust and readjust the frame by cropping it. And there you have it, a simple picture-in-picture -picture view for your video. You can even add some titles and stuff. It has everything you need for a basic level video edit. The best part is you don't need any specific hardware for this. Any device with internet and a browser allows you to log in and start your work. Now it's not perfect. I noticed that some elements like this text element doesn't exactly like resize or you know doesn't exactly set the time as you need. For example, I can't make it any smaller than what it is right now. I can't set it to a much shorter duration. There is a minimum limit for some reason. And there is this weird view that switches between a timeline view and a group view. I don't like that. I specifically selected timeline for projects, right? So I want to see this all the time. Oh, this is weird. For some reason, I can't like trim the clip in the sense I can't like split the clip in timeline view. I have to come back to this regular view and then split it. Wait, where's the text gone? Okay, that doesn't seem to be working quite quite well. This uh, splitting between the timeline view and the regular view and if you like split your clips that seems to be removing a few clips there. That's not good. Flex clip team if you're looking at this this needs some work. So as I said it's not perfect but the idea is pretty cool. You can essentially do your work on one device regardless of what hardware it has. As long as it has a reliable internet connection you're good to go. You don't have to carry your files with you. There is no chance of media getting lost. As long as the files are uploaded here you're fine. So flex clip if you could fix those overlay issues like you know if I trim the main clip overlays are getting deleted for some reason. So if you fix that then I think we have a really good editor on our hands. And again, I hope you caught those three like actual license codes floating around in this video. Just go and claim them before anyone else does.